Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use Drill Through and Power By. This feature lets you dive straight from a chart into detailed information, all with a single click. By the end of this video, you'll know exactly how to set it up and make your reports truly interactive, letting your viewers jump from summary to specifics in a smoother, smarter way. So let's get right into it. First, let's start by adding a bar chart to your Power By canvas. If you're following along and you want to use a different visualization, feel free, Drill Through works with more than just bar charts. But for this demo, let's stick with a simple bar chart since it's a popular choice for visualizing things like sales by product or revenue by region. Once you've inserted your bar chart, you'll need to add your data set. Just pick the relevant fields, maybe something like product name versus total sales, so you have some meaningful data to explore. Now hover over one of the bars in your chart. Take a second to look at the items, maybe you're working with products sold or services offered. The key here is to identify which dimension you'll use to drill through. In our case, let's say you spot a specific product that interests you. That product will be the field we use to drill through to more detail. It's a good idea to use a field where you know users might want to see deeper information, so think about what will be most useful for your audience. With that done, let's add a new page to serve as our drill through destination. Head down to the bottom of Power By and click the plus sign. This adds a blank new page. Give this page a clear and descriptive name. For this example, let's name it Drill Through. This helps keep your workspace organized and makes it clear what this page is meant for. On the Drill Through page, you'll want to set up the data that viewers will see once they arrive here. You can add tables, charts, or other visuals depending on what kind of details you want to show. Click into the visuals or sections that make sense, for instance, a detailed table showing all the transactions for the product the user picked. The most important part here is to drag the field you chose earlier, like product name, into the Drill Through field well. This sets up the page so it knows which context to filter by when someone uses Drill Through. Take your time here and double check that you've picked the right field. If things look strange later on, it's often because of a mismatch here. Once you've added your visuals and set the Drill Through field, you'll notice that Power By has automatically added a back button on the top left of the Drill Through page. If you ever want to test it out, hold down Control and click this button to jump back to your original summary page. This is really handy for navigating back and forth as you explore your report. Now it's time to try the Drill Through in action. Go back to your bar chart. Right-click on one of the bars, maybe the product you were looking at earlier, and you'll see the Drill Through option pop up. Click that and Power By will take you straight to your detailed Drill Through page filtered to just that product. This part might take a second the first time, so don't worry if there's a short pause. You should see your page update with all the specific records connected to that one product. And that's it, you've set up Drill Through with just a few steps. If you found this tutorial helpful or got stuck at any part, let me know in the comments. I always read them and I'm happy to help troubleshoot. Don't forget to hit that like button if you learned something new today, and subscribe for more easy-to-follow Power by tutorials. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.